Hello and welcome friends in Epson Printer Troubleshooting video. In this video, I tell you how to solve your misaligned printer or misaligned uh, alignment printing. As you seen in this image, you can see that the print is not properly aligned or the printing is blurry and unclear. This is because of unaligned or misaligned uh, your printing head. To in this video, I tell you how to align Epson printer head. To do this, click on start button and then go to devices and printer. Click on it. Then locate your Epson printer and right click on it. After that, click on printing preferences. Select it and then click on maintenance. Before start print head alignment you have to notice that first turn on your printer and second is remove the CD and DVD tray from your printer and third is insert a white paper in your printer printing area then click the print head alignment button click on next and then click print again now you can see a head cleaning page is uh, automatically printed in your print uh, Epson printer this will take one to five minutes during the printing wait for while the printing is complete after uh, complete the printing take the printing page and see the take your uh, printed page in your hand the head alignment page is just like this page the bands are depends on your uh, ink suppose you have six coloring then it prints three uh, four to five the lines in to uh, four to five lines in total page but if you have four color printer then it prints two to three lines in one page now check that if one of the square is blank suppose there uh, suppose in this page hash one and then number four square is blank or blurry then go back to your printer and select hash 1 and 4 and suppose hash 3 and number 3 square is blurry then select hash 3 and number 3 here and click on Align alignment after then after that you can see the change and another print alignment page is printed and the head is completely aligned using this method you can solve all of your vertical band problems with just one click if still the problem persists then you have to need to contact Epson Service Center or any technical support If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you friends and friends.